Hey guys, I'm going to be showing you today how to install Libre Elec on your Raspberry Pi. So let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need is you're going to need an application to burn the image to your SD card. A really popular option is Etcher, and you can find that at etcher.io. So we'll start with that. So we'll go ahead and our, select our image. So it's on our desktop. And so right here we have the .ing.gz and we can just open that up. All right, it has already detected our SD card, but you can change that to whatever your SD card is, and then just click on Flash. Now enter your password, and it should start, and I'll be back when that's finished. So now we're gonna plug in our Raspberry Pi, and let that power on. Libre Elex booting. All right, now Libre Elex has started, and so if your TV supports HDMI CEC, you can actually just use the remote to control it. No keyboard and mouse needed. So let's go ahead and click Next. I'm not going to connect it to a network right now. I will also turn on SSH. Click next, and next. And now we're finally into our Libre Elec installation. And so it's as simple as that to get started with Libre Elec, and that's all. Thank you guys for watching, and as always, don't forget to like and subscribe, but for now, 